Polycephaly is a condition where an animal is born with two heads. Some cultures think of it as a blessing, while others think it is a curse. Or if you're playing Fallout, a two-headed cow is pretty much normal, actually. Either way, no matter what people think, one thing we can all agree on is that creatures with this condition are truly weird. Today we're going to be looking at 10 weird two-headed animals. Better make sure you stay until number one. That entry is adorableness times two. Eh? Yeah, puns? Yeah, okay. Number 10. The Squirt and Crush. There have been quite a few cases of turtles with two heads, but most of them are one of the small varieties. It is so much rarer to find these kinds of mutations on larger species, so when a baby loggerhead turtle was discovered with two heads just a couple of months ago, the news stirred quite a bit of buzz. A sea turtle patrol on Hilton Island in South Carolina discovered an extraordinarily rare two-headed loggerhead hatchling, which was desperately trying to keep up with its brothers and sisters, who were on their way to the sea. It was very alive and energetic, but it had a deformed shell, making movement extremely difficult. The people who discovered the twins whom they affectionately named Squirt and Crush say that this is an extremely rare finding in the area, with the last discovery happening 15 long years ago. Turtle hatchlings already have a very difficult time in the wild, wherein only 1 in 1,000 are expected to survive to adulthood. If this hatchling wasn't discovered, its chances of survival in the wild are next to none. It's a good thing that the twins were discovered, this should at least give them a better chance at survival. Number 9. The Two-Headed Cardinal Birds are some of the rarest animals found with two heads. It must be because that any animal with this mutation really have little to no chance of surviving out in the wild. So when this bird was found in western Massachusetts, it was indeed quite a rare find. What makes this find even rarer and admittedly a little weirder is the fact that not only that this bird has two heads, it had two beaks as well. April Britt from Northampton noticed that cardinals had been flying around her property. Finding this strange, she went out to investigate what was happening. During her investigation, she spotted this tiny bird on the lower branches in one of the trees. Although still young, it was quite clear that the bird was already a couple of weeks old, and it was covered in juvenile feathers. The find even made it to the local news, and Britt was interviewed regarding her find. Unfortunately, the bird is not expected to live that long. Experts say that due to its deformity, even flying was an impossible feat for the poor little thing. Number 8. The First of Its Kind while two-headed turtles and birds are quite common, well, relatively speaking, this next entry on our list truly is the first of its kind. Back in 2017, a Dutch fisherman fishing in the North Sea caught something truly weird in his nets. Along with this catch of the day, he found a deformed animal, which was clearly just an infant. Unfortunately, the creature was no longer alive when it was fished out of the ocean. Thinking that it was illegal to keep such an animal, he subsequently threw it back into the sea, but not before taking a few photos of it. Upon examination of the photos, experts came to the conclusion that what the fisherman had found was a baby two-headed arbor porpoise. According to Erwin Kompaji of the National Museum of History in Rotterdam, says that conjoined twins in whales and dolphins are extremely rare, and he was only aware of nine other published cases worldwide. Number 7. Lucky the Calf Lucky the two-headed calf was born in a farm in Kentucky owned by husband and wife Stan and Brandy McCubbin. The couple said that in the seven years that they've been running the farm, they have never encountered an animal quite like Lucky. Technically speaking, Lucky doesn't have two heads, but rather has two faces, with two mouths, two noses, and four eyes. Lucky, however, only seemed to have one brain. As when the McCubbins try to feed one mouth, the other mouth moves in unison. This makes Lucky quite an even rarer case of polycephaly. A veterinary team from the University of Illinois grew interested in Lucky, and was interested to give her an operation that would potentially prolong her life. The McCubbins were even able to raise $1,200 for the operation. Unfortunately, just one week before the operation, she suddenly stopped eating and sadly passed away. She lived 108 days, making her the longest surviving calf born with two faces, with the previous record holding only about 40 days. Number 6. The Goat from Kazakhstan From one kind of livestock, we move on to another, just on the other side of the world. All the way in a small farm in Kazakhstan, a very healthy baby goat was born. Healthy, but with one small problem. It had two faces. Much like Lucky the Calf that we met earlier on, this kid was born with two faces on one head, and seems to be flourishing. In fact, a viral video was done rounds on the internet showing it to be very active. It was even suckling from its mother without any issues. 
And although it wasn't expected for livestock with these kinds of mutations rarely live to maturity, there were very high hopes for this kid. However, unfortunately, much like the other entries on our list, this story has a sad ending. Its mother, who initially allowed it to suckle from her, suddenly stopped doing it and even tried to run away from fright. Even so, the farmer didn't separate the mother and the kid. Then one night, the mother trampled the kid accidentally while trying to run away from it. A very sad ending indeed, which robbed us of the opportunity to see one of these amazing and admittedly weird animals full-grown. Ah, <sighs> rest in peace, Cody. Rest in peace. Number 5. The Two-Headed Dragon Dragons are, as far as we know, creatures of myth. No evidence of the existence of dragons have ever been unearthed, much less a two-headed one. While a two-headed dragon wouldn't be so out of place in a fantasy novel or a video game, we're obviously not talking about an actual dragon here. But it's a fact that a two-headed dragon does exist. It's alive and well and belongs to a man who is in the Guinness Book of World Records for owning the largest collection of two-headed animals. That's a very oddly specific entry, but hey, more power to him. Todd Ray, which is incidentally also a Grammy-winning record producer, is an avid collector of two-headed creatures and his specimens of two-headed bearded dragons seem to be the crown jewel of his collection. And yes, you heard right, specimens. He doesn't own only one of them. In 2010, he acquired Lefty and Poncho, and then in 2012, he acquired a second specimen, which he aptly named Jekyll and Hyde. The reason why is because Jekyll shows a more subdued behavior compared to its conjoined twin brother Hyde. Having two specimens of two-headed bearded dragons may seem excess to you, but that is only the tip of the iceberg. Ray is also a proud owner of the only specimen of a three-headed turtle. Unfortunately, the third head turtle is the only reason why I didn't make the list. You know, not to discriminate, but two heads only, three heads a crowd. Number 4. Lambs, lambs, and more lambs. Lambs seem to be the most common animals to have polycephaly. A quick Google search will show you multiple hits of this phenomenon involving lambs. As recently as 2017, a two-headed lamb was born in New South Wales. The farmer that owns it says it came as a shock to him as the lamb was born hind legs first. The poor lamb broke its leg as the farmer was trying to pull it out, but it recovered fully. No word if it reached maturity, though. Although earlier in 2008, another two-headed lamb was born at a refugee camp in the West Bank and was considered holy by farmers in the camp. Two-headed lambs were also a staple in sideshows and traveling carnivals during their heyday in the U.S. P.T. Barnum's Traveling Circus is extremely famous for showcasing such oddities, oftentimes creating ludicrous and fictional backstories. Number 3. Two-Headed Little Pigs A farmer in Luzhou, Sichuan, China was both startled and proud to discover that one of his prized sows gave birth to a litter of healthy piglets, which included one that was quite special. If it wasn't already obvious enough why this piglet was special, well, it was born with two heads. To be more specific, it doesn't have two heads, but rather two faces conjoined in one head. It had two mouths, two snouts, and three eyes. Quite predictably, it quickly became a local celebrity in that small town in China. The farmer named Zhang Guyan said that he had been raising the sow for three years before she gave birth to the pigs, including the two-headed piglet. He also added that he fed all of his animal ragweed and he didn't feed anything special to the sow. Although he was offered the equivalent of $300 for the piglet, the farmer refused to sell. Apparently, the farmer's son fell in love with it and wanted to keep it as a prized pet. Two-headed pigs seem to be not all that uncommon in China. For instance, in 2015, a two-headed piglet was found abandoned in front of a Buddhist temple in Tianjin, while another one was born in Chongqing just a couple of months earlier. Now it's time for the day's best pig. Today we're going to be looking at something that you wouldn't want to see even if it only had one head. Number 2. Bears and Snakes Today's best pic shows a photo containing two animals, which both have two heads. And both are also quite terrifying if you encounter them out in the wild. The only difference between the two is one of them is real and the other one isn't. Care to take a guess on which one is real? If your answer is the bear, then you better get your eyes checked. That one is clearly a manipulated image. Furthermore, there have been no documented instances of two-headed bears anywhere. Another thing, all animals with polycephaly rarely reach adulthood, so finding a fully grown two-headed bear is purely in the realms of fiction. For now, at least, hopefully. Two-headed snakes, on the other hand, is a totally different story altogether. Although rare, there have been numerous documented cases of two-headed snake sightings from all over the world. I'm pretty sure Todd Ray would have a couple in his menagerie. 
Anyway, the photo you are seeing is a two-headed albino melon snake, and its photo has been circulated around the internet for quite a few years now. In any case, the photo has been examined by experts and it has been determined to be 100% legit. So, two-headed snakes are real. Two-headed bears are not. Got it? Good. I saved the best for last, but first, I have a quick challenge that takes only five seconds to complete. If you can leave a like and subscribe within the next five seconds, you'll get 10 years of amazing luck. Just try it, it really works. Number one, cuteness comes in pairs. There are literally millions of cat photos and videos on the internet. It does make one think of the internet's real purpose is to propagate images of these cute little critters. And although maybe some dog people and spider people and lizard people and people who aren't cat people might disagree, cats are really cute and people who think that they are increase every day. So it shouldn't come as a surprise that this kitten's video quickly became a viral sensation. Especially when you take into account that it is quite a cute yet weird condition. Betty B was born in 2017 to a house cat in Eastern Cape, South Africa. She's one of three kittens in a litter, but Betty B has a unique trait. She was born with two faces. Betty B's double face makes it difficult for her to nurse, which meant she was at risk of starving to death. So the rescuer who wishes to remain anonymous started to tube feed the kitten. Initially, this furry little fellow was thriving, but much like all the other entries on this list, it had a sad ending. It didn't survive, dying only 16 days after birth.